Now the condition for logarithms is that the input may not be zero or less than zero. So for example if I have the logarithm of uh, base 2 of x okay so the input being the the answer part not the base this is the input okay that input may not be zero or less okay and uh, you can reason it out for yourself why not I would actually encourage you why can it not be uh, zero or less remember the question here is what exponent must I give 2 to get the answer x what exponent can we give 2 so that the answer is 0 there's no exponent I can give to 2 so that the result is 0 same with negative numbers 2 to the power of something must uh, gives me x and I'm saying that x is negative or 0 is it possible is there any exponent that I can give for 2 to give me a zero answer or a negative answer no it's impossible it's ridiculous there's no such thing in other words I may not have an input that is less than zero or even equal to zero okay so in this specific example we see that X the input must be bigger than zero okay uh, let's write that in um, bracket notation so here we have zero okay. we have everything larger than zero this would be a graphical representation of the domain x must be greater than zero and I would write it as x is an element of and I close my uh, or my bottom limit is zero I cannot be equal to zero it's an open dot so I have an open bracket in its maximum is infinity it can be any number larger than zero and I can't be equal to infinity so it's also an open bracket or actually a brown bracket okay how about the question if I have logarithm uh, of let's say x minus seven in here okay if that is my function sorry that's fx I've been writing that that's fx is equal to the logarithm of x minus 7 then I know the input x minus 7 must be bigger than 0 I solve for x so I s add a 7 on both sides and I find that x is larger than 7 if I write that in let's say uh, normal just as an expression I would just say x is an element of r but x is larger than 7 Okay, finally, let's look at one more example. Let's look at the logarithm. Let's say base 3. The input is x plus 2. And we have a plus 9, not as an input, but outside. Okay, in this case, once again, it's just the input that we're concerned about. The plus 9 is outside of the logarithm uh, because it's outside of the bracket. So we know that the input is x plus 7. That must be bigger than 0 which means that to solve it, sorry, not plus 7, plus 2, I subtract a 2 on both sides, and therefore I get that x is larger than negative 2. So if I write that in set notation, I say, well, x is an element of the set. First of all, the biggest condition is that x must be a real number. Any real number we can use, but the, more s the stricter conditions now follow, x must be larger than negative 2. That is another way of writing this uh, domain.